Welcome back to Wasteland 3, folks. We are heading in here to take care of these people and find out what's going on. So let's move Hawk up. There's someone right there, it looks like. Or is it someone? Uh, it's probably someone who's been beheaded. Uh, Jody, you come back here. Zeus, come back here. Uh, Jody. Why don't you shoot that guy? Nice! Very nice. That was a one hit kill. You see ya? Ah, just out of range. Alright. Actually, let's just... No, I did not want to do that. Damn it. Alright, Lucia, get back here. Uh, get back here. Damn it. Alright, Hulk. If you come up here, then you can smack that guy. Good hit. Unfortunately, you can't do it again, so you'll defend. Zeus. Come up here. And you can shoot that guy. Ah, oh, don't hit Hawk! Defend. Damn it. Quan. Don't hit Hawk. Defend. Jody, you come up here. Sallow. You come over here, you'll only have one shot. Hawk is probably gonna go down. Oh, nice. Pair. It's a long run. Okay. That's all good. Ooh, nice hit there, Growler Cub. Hawk. You are gonna heal yourself. And then you're gonna smack this guy. Should have stunned him there, but never mind. Let's see, uh, Lucia. Can you hit that guy from here? No. Hmm. So, yeah, it only has ten. So, ten armor that is. Let's hit him in the head. Nice. Boss kill. Uh, let's come up here. And then we'll start shooting this guy. Tiny hit. Defend. Defend. Lucia, come over here and finish him off. Nice. Then I think you'll ambush. Jody, not very good hit chance, not very good hit chance, not very good hit chance, not very good hit chance. Let's come over here. 89% hit chance, I kind of like that. Defend. Zeus. Come over here, 23, 10. Let's 
Let's actually throw out a machine turret. And then prepare. Nice. Gas grenade. Alright, that's a couple of poisons. Ow! That hurt. The ground cup does really good damage. And so let's head over here. Couple of good hits. Let's get in there. That's him down. Defend. Hmm. That guy is dead. It's only sixteen percent chance to hit. He's out of t out of range. You know what? Come over here and pick her up. Seven. Oh, just ambush him. Come on. You need to heal, that's for sure. And what is that effect you have there? Leader boss kill. Okay. Melee damage bonus. Don't really care about that. Flesh pocket. Defending. Frozen. Ah, he's frozen. That's why he has so few action points, of course. Well, 31% chance to hit. It's better than nothing. Lucia. Ah. That. Hit him in the body. Good. And come back here. Try and hit him again. Good. Jody, you need to heal. Decent hits. Nice. Alright, Cello, why don't you use some antidote? Actually, no, wait, come over here first. Out of the poison, then use some antidote. And then use a bit of healing. Actually, defend. Hawk. Oh, she's frozen as well. Hawk, oh, come up here. Do some antidote. Defend. Okay. Jody. Why don't you come back here? Take a shot at him. Nice. Zeus. I really don't want you to run through that poison. You won't really be able to hit anyway, so... Let's run over here. And prepare. One. Alright, he's dead. Okay, she's dead. Uh, prepare. Lucia. Just 
come over here and defend. That's fine. Okay, our garlic cub is there. We did it. Nice. Okay. Now, our growler, growler cub is poisoned, so we need to do something about that sickle bladed weapon. Okay. Uh, not that much great stuff. Not that much great stuff. Um, Hulk. Looks like the pipes lead from this room to the sauna. You give that to the Growler Cub. I wish I could see how much health it has. How do I see how much health my pet has? Hmm. Alright, so Jody needs an injury kit. And then we have some low ups. So, Hawk has a level up. Uh, let's see, skills. You have all the leads, uh, the science, that weird science that you need, I think. Um, hmm. Right, let's stick some speed in there. I think we'll hold on to to those for now. Then you Hmm. We have four points. So we could do big guns. Or we could save up. Who is it that needs to get there's maxed because we have a very very nice item for them uh, it's this one isn't it no nope. this one that's uh that's lucia and that needs small arms uh, maxed for the auto shotguns hmm I do want to get explosives up. I think I'll leave that for now. Uh, then we'll do awareness. And Quan has a level up. We're doing explosives for him, so let's just keep doing that. And... Hmm... What do I want to do for attributes? Why does he have so high strength? Is it because I wanted to give him some armor? Oh, he can actually use tank armor. Plus 9, plus 10. Let's give him tank armor. Not the tank helmet, though, I think. Armor plus seven, armor plus nine. So I don't think he needs more strength. Let's give him some speed. And there's Jody. Uh, I am saving up for her so she doesn't count. All right. Let's take a look here. Experiment in progress. Nerd stuff. Admin override. Shut down experiment. 
Uh, nerd stuff. Terminating experiment. Disabling gas. Unlocking airlock. Alright. Who are you? The door is open. The gas is vacant and a middle-aged man has exited the room. Mission completed. Raising a little hell. Addendum added. A psychopath. That's okay. Eston Ward. What in blazes did they do to him? I don't know, Lucia. He starts coughing violently, then after a brief pause he begins hyperventilating and shaking. First aid. It appears to be a side effect of whatever drugs were in the gas. Uh, tell him to concentrate on slowing his breathing. Slowly, steadily, he calms down and begins breathing normally. His mouth twitches, trying to form words. His brow wrinkles at the sound of his own voice. The gas took his voice, but he's stable. There's nothing more you can do for him. Okay. Let's see what else is in here. Gas victims. The corpses of those who could not survive the sonic gas experiments has been piled in this corner. Okay, and then there's explosive barrel, and that's it. Alright, well, we got him out, at least. And there's something back here. Mm, let's just see, are there any... There's a container there that we need to check. And there's some corpses lying around. Um, but we can't really do anything with them, it seems. Maybe if we drain the pool or something. Use sauna maintenance key. Alright. What do we have in here? We have an ammo box. And a container. Let's loot before we do anything else. Alright. Where was the container? It was over there. Dollars. And then... We can take a look at this. Computer display reads, Sandy Clean Pool Hygiene Monitoring System, which means 37,165 days at the last water quality test. Do you wish to test the water quality of your pool now? Uh, yes. Commencing water quality test. Warning, high levels of human blood and other bodily fluids detected. pH level is normal. Do you wish to drain the pool? Yes. Commencing drain cycle. Uh, warning, the presence of human remains in your pool may avoid your warranty. Contact customer service for details. Okay. Cool. Nothing else in here, right? Nope. Alright. Uh, then there was... Now, I am curious about those bodies, but I want to take a look at this container first. Uh, everybody shits. Lore book. The dog-eared composition book smells like an outhouse, but it's, its pages are packed with dense lines of chemical formulae. Okay. And the holiday catalog. Which is junk. Alright, let's check the corpses, I guess. Mm. Columbium barrel, weapon mod, damage plus four, nice. Colorado dollars, let's check this corpse. Colorado dollars. Colorado dollars. Colorado dollars and an extended mag. Okay. Was that really all that was down there? That wasn't that interesting. Okay. Alright, uh, let's try and talk to... Okay. No talking to him. Hey, nope. Rangers. This is Woodsy. On the hostages. Uh, all hostages are accounted for. So you located and secured all five hostages? Outstanding. The man is gonna love hearing all about this once we get back to the Ranger HQ. Heck, you might even get a medal. Now let's keep your success going. Go take care of business with Victory Buchanan. Eyes sharp, Rangers. Yeah, uh, first, we're gonna go check, uh, on the guy in the room here. You make me kill you. I did 
I didn't wanna do it. You made me scare you and scalp you with a razor. A dirty, rusty razor. You made me happy sometimes. You made me glad. But in the end, baby, you just made me. Uh huh. That song is actually really good in uh, in its real version. Uh, you made me love you. It's a great song. You made me love you. I didn't wanna do it. I didn't wanna do it. Great song. You wouldn't want Vic to get angry. He's not very nice when he's angry. He's not very nice. I don't really care. No. Okay. Um, I surrender. I guess. <laughs> Good okay. job at saving all those hostages. To be honest, I really didn't want to kill them. Like, not at all. Okay. Uh, in my defense, I told you it was Vic's orders. I didn't want to kill anyone, but I can help you now that you're here, right? I can give you the key to Vic's place. Sounds good. Fine, hand it over. You can also take the key from you by force. Well, okay, fine. Okay, but you ain't allowed to kill me after. <laughs> or if you're gonna, you should give me a chance to run first. Fair is fair. <laughs> Weirdo. Moving slowly, reaches for a chain hanging around his neck, unfastens it, and tosses it over to you. Okay. I remember Victory's boys. This one's harmless compared to them. And he's nothing next to Vic himself. Eyes closed, handshaking, awaits your judgment. Arrest. You're going to jail for a long time. Free. Get out of here. Attack. Kill him. Arrest. Wow. I was like mega sure I was dead there. You're good people. I mean that. Ow. Flexing his skinny shoulders, smile up at you while cringing. It's an impressive feat. What we're doing in here anyway. What can you tell us about this place? Ash is an interesting name. We have to go. What we're doing in here. Oh. I was supposed to check in with our guys and keep Vic informed about the prisoners. You know, let Vic know which torture methods were working well and which weren't. Okay, so you knew what they were doing to Eston Ward the whole time. So we were just following orders and standing around while innocent people were tortured. Uh, so you were just standing around. Yes, but that wasn't my fault. Vic told them to do it, and it's not like I could stop them if I wanted to. Um... Let's talk about Vic. Sure thing, boss. What do you want to know? Uh, what are his weak weaknesses? Well, uh, he's pretty tough and good with bombs and guns. I've known him a long time, and he ain't afraid of much, but he does a lot of drugs. A ton of drugs. And he likes to lock himself up to be alone when he does. Like now. Okay. Uh, what is Vic, what's he doing here? What's Vic's plan? Oh, well, he wants to take over Colorado Springs. Everyone knows that. Ain't even a secret. He's gonna take his army, that's us, and the breathers, and we're gonna storm the walls, maybe attack it from within. It kind of depends on Vic's mood. Storm the walls, huh? He's planning to win the heart and minds of the people first, is he? And that sounds like a really shitty plan. Storm the walls, huh? Oh, yeah. Or like... Blow up generators and attack the walls? I ain't sure. Like I said, Vic's still thinking things. All the okay. plans basically have us sabotaging stuff while the breathers take on the Patriarch's marshals. Like as cannon fodder, you know? That way we don't get hurt. Oh, uh, I probably shouldn't have said that last part. It was told to me in confidence. Don't know the business <laughs> I said. Okay. Uh, tell the breather, breathers, got it. Uh, Ash grimaces, then closes his eyes. It seems he's opting to ignore what you just said. Anyway, that's all I know about what Vic's gonna do, okay? That's it. Alright. Uh, what can you tell us about this place? Uh, not much, boss. I mean, the hostages were spread all over this place, and we dumped the people Vic killed in the storage room. Vic's in his dad's old suite. He's got some of his tougher friends in there. The ones who always pick on me, you know? Okay. As for your ranger friends, uh, let's see. 
Two of them were being tortured, but I don't know where Vic put them. You probably already saw the radio guy, uh, Woody or whatever. And the green chick is in the lab with Gift. That's the breather lady. Okay. We have to go. Stay here in case we need you. Got it, boss. I'll just stay right here. All right. Uh, let's see. There are some things in here. Looks like Ash was making explosive barrels out of fertilizer. Okay. There's a medical crate. A med hypo. There's an ammo box. And there's a safe. Flamethrower fuel. And some commando armor. Okay. Cool, cool. Alright. Now, we are out of time. So we'll have to go deal with Vic in the next one. I guess he's in here. So yeah. We'll, we'll do that in the next one, guys. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and subscribe. And I'll see you next time.